Well, he seems like the perfect, perfect guy. He's got the charm. He's chivalrous. He's got these bedroom eyes. He's this perfect lips. Uh, yeah, we're doing this. Yeah, we we're are. And the only thing he's missing is this relationship. Hopefully, that's me. <laughs> Kaylin. Ah! ah! I got the first date. I'm so excited. So we accept this rose. Our sexual chemistry, our intellectual chemistry, everything is flying off the charts. I need to guarantee that I stay. So I guess I gotta do whatever it takes. Why Where's Kaylin? Hey. Can I talk to you? Yeah. And what is she doing back there? You really think that was appropriate? If that were him and I sitting in there making out in front of you, you'd be in that bathroom bawling your eyes out. It's like, what are you gonna do? Respect everyone because we're all friends? It just takes me back to like my childhood and being picked on. We're all gonna feel okay. different emotions. Wait. Can't talk to you, Kaylin. I'm gonna <laughs> punch someone right now. Kaylin is extremely dramatic. I don't think she's strong enough to handle this. I can't believe it, I can't okay. believe it. Okay. Either she's not gonna be able to handle it. I shouldn't feel emotions. I shouldn't feel anything. Or Tim's just gonna be like, I'm done handling it. I can't stand bullying. I, I told you. She's cracking. It just triggers something. I tried. <laughs> Not many people get to see their most volatile and emotional moments played back for them on television. <laughs> yeah. Thank uh, you for that. <laughs> how does that feel seeing that? It's not nice to watch. Um, it's quite embarrassing, truthfully. Viewers had a lot to say about your behavior on the show. Yes. People just, they flat out say, I hate Kaylin, or she's bipolar, she needs to go to rehab. I'm pretty sure it was almost close to trending on Twitter as Cray Cray Kaylin. <laughs> it's hard to just like bite my tongue and not, yeah, defend myself and, and say anything. But well, defend yourself now. Here's your opportunity. I guess all I would have to say is don't judge someone when you don't really know them. And your words do more damage than you think. Well, you know, uh, Martha, you were at the center of one of Kaylin's legendary meltdowns. Yes, I was, unfortunately. <laughs> I was so surprised because from one second to the next, she went Donkey Kong on me. <laughs> I was like... <laughs> to be honest, I think bullying is a very serious issue. So I think for her to have used that term, it was inappropriate. I don't think I should have used the word bully. And honestly, gosh, I don't even remember that night, but... I remember it. <laughs> um, Martha was just in the wrong place at the wrong time. So we did work it we out. We did actually hug it out. Yeah, we, we hugged it out. We hugged it out. What, what was the hardest part of... Um, you know, we had the chance to build this connection and then it felt like um, like a one night stand. Like not only do you not hear from that person that you thought you had such a great time with, you also have to sit back and watch them start dating other people and like building a connection with them. It was like doomed from the very beginning. I think we all got a real sense of how it must have hurt. I think you handled it very well. Thank you.